Hello everybody and welcome back to another Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. episode. I just watched the trailer for Spider-Man Far From Home and I'm I'm so hyped. I I am so excited and I'm so hot because I yelled so much and I'm Tom Holland of course I'm gonna be hot. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna go to jail. No wait, he's he's not underage, right? I'm not going to jail. Anyways, this is season 3 episode episode 20 which is going to be Full slash extended. So the pressure is on. Uh, em what? Eman emancipation. You might want to buckle up. What? What? Well, that looks like so much fun. She's all pale. She's literally draining herself. They're very persistent. Broken spirit that worries me. He hasn't been the same since Daisy. Well, his partner, someone that he loves very much, keep the shit out of him. Okay. Oh. I need you to forget about Daisy. She already knows everything about us, and she's going to get in eventually. Time to stop playing defense and get back on offense. Lock her. I need you okay, to start thinking like Hans inside his twisted brain. General would like to see what you can do. Oh, show him, babe. Anytime. Thank you. <laughs> it's a protected list. It's highly classified. You yeah, I don't trust Which that. Which is why I know nothing good ever comes from putting people on lists. Eventually. Boy, what the fuck are you doing? Well, well, well. It isn't the hothead that tried to kill my bodyguard. What's he doing in here? <laughs> I thought this was a germ-free zone. <laughs> to remember each other. Be careful. He's broken. I swear, whatever he does to them, it's... They're cute, though. Look at them. You need a beer and some faith. Uh, Latinos and their faith. You ever wonder if that's the word we use to to fool ourselves? Because it fears the strong. I love it. <laughs> I don't think I've ever shipped anyone here in Shield this fast. I, I mean, the very first second I saw them, I was like, I shoot them. Save all the fun till we're back at the base. You keeping monsters on your base now? Breathe, General. It was Dr. Garner before he changed permanently. Permanently. Rasta Hope is your husband? I don't Rasta care. Rasta Hope. Hope used to be. Oh, what so shit. Who follows a stranger down a dark alley dressed as pups? I mean, on principle alone, I can't let this end well for you. That must hurt. You're leaving so soon. That's it. This is exactly why the Sokovia Accords were created. This is a nightmare scenario. She's a nuclear weapon in the wrong hands. I'm gonna have to agree with Tyler here. How many of these inhumans is he controlling? Not many. He I hope they melt it. I mean, poor people, but I hope they melt it. We may need some more blood. They can't take any more blood. Make him sound invincible. Calm down, General. You'll pull something. Calm down? This is an end of the world type deal. Don't you tell me to calm down. I'm the one that tells you to calm down. <laughs> so <would> calm down. <laughs> I'm getting used to this. If they melted, please tell me they melted. Oh my god. What have I done? Well, they didn't melt. 
held. I think you overcooked them, Doc. Oh my God, those are so I scary as fuck. You can't even keep track of your blue disc in port seven and gold disc in port four. Could you use an extra hand? Mac. Uh, well, actually, I could use about seven, but one of them. <laughs> Mac is not gonna fight against Lingo, right? Cause, baby. You're hurt, Mac. Let me go. I gotta get to Daisy. You're on a fool's errand. The only reason she's helping you so hard can make you one of them. Mac, you don't understand? I need to go. I'll keep your arms pinned down all day if I have to. Don't make me do this! Yeah, I forgot about that. Oh my god, Lincoln, he's... I don't know if he's innocent or what the fuck is going on. He, he must know. What happened to them? You happened to them. Our children, really. From our own flesh and blood. And we're gonna make more of them. So we'll need more blood. All of it. So you're basically killing her? What? Sometimes. Desperate measures. Yes, Lash. But he... He can't control the inhuman. Listening to everything so that she trusts me and believe that I really want it out. You had me fooled. Anybody can fool you. I never trusted Daisy. Who put him on the Quinjet? I did. While Coulson was keeping you distracted. You knew about this? I mean, he's the director! Why do you think this Lash can defeat Hive? Because he was created to kill inhumans. Every inhuman is here for a reason and serves a purpose. Can he control him, though? He haven't done the thing, so I'm guessing he can't. Daisy. That wasn't Lash. Oh, no. immediate blood transfusion and full cranial scan. How do we know this isn't a trap? That she isn't under Hive's voodoo spell? We'll know soon enough. In the meantime, have a little faith. Aw. I'm not crying. That thing he stole from the ATCU in Indiana. It was a warhead. A fully operational warhead. He doesn't have to bug anymore, right? Does this mean you see a future now? <laughs> well, I need a fast way out of here. Daisy's back. 
That's a good thing, right? Do you still think we can't win? Without Lash, though, he was a... I'm ready to stand and fight. Give me your hands. <laughs> Close your eyes. Don't open them until I leave. For a cross? Keep the faith, Alfonso Mackenzie. Alfonso? If it's the cross, that's such a Latino thing. Don't. <laughs> this early in the finale it's not the finale yet we have a few more episodes like two a couple i don't know i'm not supposed to cry at this point but lash lash finally died and her his purpose was not to i don't think to specifically save daisy but to save the humans that have been poisoned by hive and he could have saved the other dude. The other dude needs to die though, because he was never supposed to be an, in an inhuman anyways. Lash had a thing, that he had a purpose. He had a purpose. He had a reason to be killing all these inhumans and shit. Wow, damn, wow, damn! <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this episode with me, and as always, I'm Saramiano, and I'll see you in my next video. I am Peter Pan, I'll never be a man if you never want to grow Take my hand, I'll take you to Neverland I am Peter Pan